I don't know how, what your feelings are on what tra transpired at the Os Oscars, but looking at the fallout and the aftermath, do you believe Will Smith will ever be what he once was? I think it'll be tough. I, I, I think that it really will be a tough call. I know that, you know, that this is a town that is about that business of business, and Will Smith has proven to be a box office star, you know. Uh, has that star been dampered or dim sure. So right. will the people take these chances? Yeah, and if he's able to do it again and hit when he hit, King Richard was out at the time that it happened, but it's again a successful movie that still plays every day, right? right. And he won the Oscar the night he did the actual deed. And right. so people don't relate them as the same thing right. for whatever reason, right? There's, there's that deed and then King Richard. And you're like, oh, I like that movie and I'm willing to watch it maybe because it's about Serena and them in a bigger story, but I, I don't put them in the same category. So, you know, I mean, they're both good dudes to me. And right. so it was, it was unfortunate to see it happen. You know, and I'm two sides in the corner. I got in trouble for a joke because I felt like sometimes, you know, somebody got to get the shit slapped out of them. I ain't right. saying it's, it's... It should have it, been Chris. Chris. But but somebody, I mean, people act like that ain't a real thing in life. Right. Like, that's a thing that people forget because we live in this Twitter world right. and everybody feel like they can say what they want to say and you, people forget, oh, it's a part of the world. Somebody exists, you might get the shit slapped out of you. Right. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> I ain't saying it should have been Chris. Did the apology seem sincere? I mean, he's come out. I mean, I thought, I thought when he got up there to accept the award, said, this is just me. He apologized to everyone, the Academy and this one and that one, but not the man he had just slapped. He was mad that night. He was really mad, dog. And like, and I don't know exactly what the thing was, but what all, all I tell people, in my opinion, is for you to physically get up and go and walk 20 feet. In that place. To, in, in that, place. At, at that moment. In the place. If you ever been in a fight, bro, yeah, yeah. you understand, like, you on that football field, y'all out there grinding. You t if you get outside yourself mm -hmm. for the moment that you literally about to fight another person, you not you not who you are. Right. Period. It, do, it just don't happen unless you're a brute. Right. Like, if you're a brute and you walk around thugging people, right. that's you. But most human beings, dog, for me to literally go, I'm going to walk up and slap shit up. Right. I'm, I'm not me right, right. now. I'm, so, I'm outside my normal way of being. And that's the truth because I've, I've had physical altercations and I can remember not knowing what happened, why. Why, what led to it. I just was, it was on. You said something, you spit on me, you called me there. It happened, we went. We right. didn't, you know, everything else was out the window. All the decorum. And yeah. The, the what proper, about the movie? What about the movie? Yeah, what, what about, about the movie? What am I doing? Oh, that, this dude walked 30 feet to he do that. He did. You don't do that, dog. You don't do that in a natural sense of state. That's not a not a human reaction to something unless right. you wake up every day as a villain. Right. That's, that's what villains do. Right. But a normal person ain't going to walk 30 feet to go slap somebody. You mad, for real. You know what to do. Hit the subscribe button and become an official member of Club Shay Shay, where we do something before two something.